Man, what's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, B Blitz, man. I'm back at another video for y'all boys, man. Me and my boy, Vax T, man. What's good, y'all? Yeah, man. We reacting to Shiloh, man, Sanders, and his old boy, his dad, man. We gonna see it. And, hey, react to it straight up, man. Let's get straight into it. Get it. Welcome into the season finale of Coach Prime's Playbook. And, boy, when I say we save the best for last, we got not one, but two Sanders in Prime the house. Time. Two 21s in the house. Shiloh gonna join us for the whole show today. Shiloh, yeah. I love it. Since you fam, like no cap, bro, I just love their like son and dad vibes. Yeah, like, all his so sons for real, bro. Like, bro, I dream to have kids that I'm just so close to. They're just like friends to me, bro. It's awesome. Facts, I, I facts. It, bro. I enjoy it. I think they always got sp good swag too. Not for sure. Like for they sure. be. Putting this stuff on, for bro. sure. <laughs> like, and I don't know if they get it from their pops or if it's probably, just natural. Probably, man. but hey. prime time. Come on now. So you're here. We're gonna start off with you. Another tough loss. What's prime really like when you guys lose? Well, we haven't lost <laughs> almost our whole life, so I'm not really Dang. used to like seeing him after a loss. But I don't know how he's been taking it because this is really new for him. Any team we've ever been on, we've won. This about to get personal. Win. Yeah. We're gonna win. Uh, one thing about he and Shador, he's he's right. We we really hadn't lost in our lives, mm -hmm. uh, especially consistently. But they always handle their business, mm -hmm. and I respect the heck out of that because they know okay. you can't lose and have your sons a part of the equation of the loss. They they got to be complementary to the win, mm -hmm. not the loss. And I'm really, really, you know, I haven't, I've told him this a million times. I'm so proud of him and what he's accomplishing this year. He has a knack of getting that ball out. He has a knack <laughs> of getting the ball. He plays physical. He has a violent nature inside of him. Uh, and, and I love the way he's, he's going about his job this year. Uh, I was actually saying off air, I love the way Shiloh plays. He just plays hard hitting Appreciate football. It's so mm -hmm. fun. But you look, even in the NFL, I always... You think they got a, like, expectation? You know how, like, anytime, yeah. like, think of, like, LeBron, any great, mm -hmm. anytime you got, like, a uh, uh, family member right. who in a higher, like, right. echelon, right. it's always this, like, kind of, like, I don't even know how to explain it. Yeah, man, but it's this what? pressure, you know? You feel like they got it like a pressure, and I'm that's sure, what make them perform better? I'm sure it is, and I'm sure that their dad kind of like paved that way, that yeah. route for them, not only... And, I, and I, I think dad also speak life to them and tell them, hey, don't be like me, but be better. Yeah. You know, exceed what I've done. But, you know, dad played ball, baseball, that's football. Tough. He did a lot. <laughs> but, I mean, I think what they're doing now, bro, shot no, Shadur, actually, like, bro, he got like... One point something million views, like he's exceeding his dad. Yeah. You know, you know, he's just doing it his way, his way, right? Yeah. So I feel like, bro, it's always this like expectation of kind of being better or kind of like following in your parents' footsteps since they were great. But as far as that, I feel like they're doing great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that too. All in all, I feel, like See, I feel like it's hard to play defense these days. Do you yeah. ever think about can I sustain that at, at this level and at the next level? Yeah, it's really just up to the refs. And um, I see a lot of hits they make in the NFL that, you know, if you go according to the targeting call I had, mm -hmm. it wouldn't be targeting the NFL. Uh -oh. But I've seen a lot of vice, vice versa calls. So it's really just up to the ref. But there's nothing I could control. I just got to play hard. Well, I told him the money is getting the ball. Yeah. Forget the hit. <laughs> but I, when no, you no, get them hard I, enough, I, 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 yeah, I want, no. yeah. I want. I, the How thing is, yeah. like, I don't think that. That's a targeting call. I don't think so either. But it is something that he could have done about that. He, he could have tackled yeah. lower. Yeah. That's yeah. the only, like, yeah. he could have tackled lower. He did. But at the same time, you're not thinking of that. You're thinking, let me hit him. Yeah, like, that's bro. all you're thinking. I like. see, bro, with the ball. I and it's like, smack him, bro. on one hand, you're trying to protect the people. Exactly. On the other hand, you want people to play football. That's right. the sport. You right. know what you signed up for. Right. So it's like, what it's tiptoeing like? the line. Nope. I feel like if you review that call, it shouldn't be a target. No doubt. Um... I agree. But I guess as a, a ref, you could argue. He could have just tackled over. You can, yeah. You know? How you felt? Same. Same? Yeah, same, honestly, yeah. Okay. I want you to, but I really want you to go get that, that 21 ball. look good yeah. on you the You know, side. go <laughs> get that football. You know, sometimes they say with, with, with turnovers, some guys just have a knack. Yeah, right? that's how it is. Yeah, he, 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 he does. You got that? You got that turnover gene? What's that about? I mean, how do you get yourself <laughs> turnover the right gene is crazy. <laughs> 
um, I just get the call from Coach Kelly, you know, and yeah. just do my job, try to do it full speed, and things just happen, you know. Yeah. yeah. Got to pray before the game. <laughs> Amen. So things just work out. Yeah. I want to go back to something you said at the beginning when you talk about you guys have, have kind of won your whole lives. Yeah. What have you learned about, about yourselves this season? Well, what you said, this is one of the most trying seasons of, of your life. Yeah, well, first of all, I said that, and I was up under the influence of a lot of medication. <laughs> <laughs> Fair. <laughs> let's get, let's get this straight. I mean, I was, I was just, I was out of it. Like, I don't even remember the flight home. Mm. I was so Dang. medicated, and I was so <laughs> drunk. <dumb. laughs> what medication you on? You can't remember That's the flight. That's odd. That, no, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> I'm playing, bro. I'm playing, I'm bro. Playing. The, not remembering the flight, the flight home is crazy, bro. But I do feel like he is in one of them areas where it's like exactly. it's make yeah. or break. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And it's one of them situations where either you step up to the plate and you hit a home run, most definitely, or you strike out. You strike out. You know. I agree. And I think he's doing a good job. A great like, job. And not only conducting himself through the wins, you know, but Fair also conducting job. himself through the losses, most definitely. And that's really what. It's about not not even just getting all of the, all of the wins, mm-hmm. but no matter what happened, handling that the right way. Exactly, you know, and they exactly. doing that with class. Exactly. And like I think their record prior to him coming was like one and something. yeah, like they like already four and yeah. four. And it's like you know what, even like we expected them to kind of do better, but it's like come on, you know, be honest, new team roster, new guys, they have to kind of gain yeah. that. You feel me? to grow. So I feel like by next season if they let Prime get the guys that he want to get, the guys from Florida and them boys, <laughs> hey Prime going up, fam. I love it. Hey, but I feel up. like I feel like they shouldn't put that pressure on him. Any other coach, Why's regular that? coach? Yeah, yeah. Like that's what I'm saying like. Mm-hmm. We judging him off of that's Prime. Fam, he's black. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Right. But any other coach, right. we going to give him time to build. Exactly. Why is it the expectation to be the best year one? Fam, like that's not even realistic. I think I think Prime says something, and, and I quote, and he he said they're they're basically going against him. They're yeah. not trying to go against the players. It's really him. Cause like whenever Prime like switched to um Colorado, it was just so much like media and so much like people like their their page um was at two hundred and fifty k is at one point something million. Yeah. So Prime brought all of that Fetch. to that school. So I just feel like, bro, they just expected him to just exceed. Yeah. But it's like, bro, I'm only one wait. person. You know what I'm like, saying? Yeah. yeah. They tweaking. <laughs> Stick. Um, that night before and and leading up to that that game, I I think he came in and checked on me once before the game, and he, you know, he, they play for it. I'm sick as a dog. I'm on the IVs, and they want to play. On a, on a joking <laughs> clown. But uh, it was, uh, it was, it was tough. Mm-hmm. It was tough. And uh, when I say one of the toughest times, just like to reiterate what Shadow said, we, yeah, we had lost. Lot. And we're going to win, and he knows the process. And we've been places, uh, when we was at Jackson, it's the same darn process, isn't it? Just yeah. think about it like this, like, you know, this is our coach. Mm-hmm. He's the leader of this team. And if he could play, you know, that could help us a lot. But he can't play. <laughs> yeah. So he wants to win. But all, all he could do is just, you know, try to lead us to win. But we actually, the players have to actually go out and do the things the coaches call. Mm-hmm. So when we don't do that, mm-hmm. that results in things like little mistakes that can give up yards here, yards right. there. Right. And then, and the you know, he just matter. gets all the blame for it. But it's really just. Yeah, but that comes with the territory. Because you right. don't yeah. get the credit, you got to get the blame. I'm, I'm, exactly. I'm built for that. Most I'm used definitely. to that. I don't want Most you definitely. guys getting the blame. I'd rather take that. I'll take that. But it's so funny that, and he says this all the time, you can say the same thing everybody sees on television, but if you say it, it's a problem. Right. <laughs> so you're used to that, right? right. You know people are going to yeah. love it or hate it one right. way or another. Right, right, right. It's been that way our whole life, and he knows that. He's going to be criticized just like Shador is going to be criticized. Um, but I'm- Fam, I'm sorry to keep on like pausing it, but like I inspire to be a leader like that, bro. Yeah. Like, not yeah. only a leader, but a dad, bro. It's just like, bro, when I, I, I watch them, right, they're like, connection and how he speaks to his kids and how he pour into his kids and also he's a uh, man of God too I yeah. just feel like he's such a great leader just a man of just great you know wisdom bro yeah and I find that really cool bro facts yeah. because you can see the the reason the relationship feels so good and genuine yeah, is because genuine. you can see a good person right reflecting 
onto their son. Wow. Like he, they son got the same character, same you know? same vibe. And because exactly. he got a good character, exactly. now you seeing that ripple exactly. effect. You know, exactly. you see it through his kids, and then not only through his kids, but all of the people under him. Right. And that's the the leadership that you right. kind of want to have as a right. person, right. which takes some work. Right. And then you hear the stories about not only the success, but the Most struggles definitely. of like the surgeries, him being on the IV, Facts. him not being able to remember the flame, the Facts. plane, like the little stuff like that. Facts. That's where like you, you basically hear folk tales, like it's legendary. Yes. So you kind of want to, yes. no matter what I face, no matter what I go through, yeah. I'm going to stand on my business. Most definitely. I'm going to handle it with class. Most definitely. And I'm going to think about it before yeah. I, you know. Like. Yeah. And, and, and then plus to um add on to that, we had watched a video of the guy. It was a guy. He, he was saying to kind of go up, you got to start from low. Right. And it's like Prime went through a lot, bro. It's like we see him here and he's just at this high yeah. mountain. And we think, oh, my God, he just got to know he went through a lot, bro. He 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 had a, like a, a, a suicide attempt. Yeah. I, I heard he was on the verge of d- killing himself. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, look where he, he's at now. So Facts. it's like, man, this is great. This is awesome. Yeah. I love it. But also, they're going to get a lot of the credit when we win. Yeah, absolutely. So that I, comes I, with it. I want to I keep going with this, but I do want to talk a little bit about the next opponent, too, before yeah. I forget. So let's take a look at who's next. We got the reigning Pac-12 champs, Utah, Dang. coming up right now, a battle out. <laughs> the other Rocky Mountains coming up. Once again, Barnes off the screen, got a block from Keaton Bills, and Sione Faki into open space again, and he is in! <laughs> Jaquindon Jackson breaks through the day line. Jackson to the 10, Jaquindon Jackson with a... Yeah, ball. yeah. And it's first down for Utah. That's over Yards after the catch. Wow! Who y'all think winning that game, bro? Man, you know what, bro? I feel like... Since it's Colorado last game, bro, I feel like the guys should just lock in, bro. They have a great chance. I ain't gonna, I yeah. think that's a great team. They have some dogs on that team, bro. They got guys like Travis Hunter. They got Shador, the, the quarterback, a dog. You know what I'm yeah. saying? They got Shiloh. Bro, they got um number 10, number 5, Jimmy Horn. Bro, they got some great guys on that team. I feel like if the guys lock in and give this game one good last, you know, yeah, push. run, yeah. they got this, bro. Because, bro... Um, the biggest team was TCU, I think. Yeah, they they smacked them, fool. You know what I'm saying? Cause they had that that hunger. Yeah, they was coming into coming it and in, they wanted you know, to prove they stuff. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I think you know, um, Colorado over time had a lot of spotlight, and I think that kind of like changed the, the guys' mindsets and all that. Yeah, so I just feel like once the guys kind of gained that mindset, regardless of we had spotlight, whatever it may be, we got to attack it the in, same way. We got this, bro. Yeah, with the same focus yes. as like yes, we facing. Somebody who we need to beat. Exactly. Like they need to exactly. attack it every single time like that. Most definitely. I think it's going to come down to, it's going to be a game of mistakes. Oh, yeah. Who make the most mistakes? Oh, yeah. Because you could have all of the pieces. You could be a great team. For sure. But who going to have the most mistakes? For sure. Who going to not have the most Who going to sure. execute when they need to execute? Most definitely. Making big plays. Most you definitely. know, breaking those extra tackles. Little yep. stuff like that. Yeah. Make a huge difference. And blocking up front. That's yeah. really like the game changer. Yeah. You could get your men up front to hold their blocks. So that you can at least try to execute the plays Protect and make a huge difference. I yep. see when I watch Colorado play like the big big teams, mm-hmm. a lot of it be like we just can't get no blocking. Yeah, you know? yeah. and part of that it is recruiting, but part of that is just wanting it, wanting like you said. It. Yeah, that dog in them. All right, let's take a look at the Utes, seven and four. They did just lose to Arizona. Uh, they had a really hot start, but they've lost three of four since starting six and one, ten and two. First, the Buffs as a member of the Pac-12. And, of course, the last, this is the last game is it. of Pac-12 play. You're going against a team that really is kind of the epitome of, of consistency. How yeah. much would it mean to get a win as you, you're exiting well, the Pac-12? That's, that's, that's huge. What you want. Let me tell you something. I, I, I love this coach, mm-hmm. what he's about, his standard, his level of consistency that he's displayed in that Respect. team, the way they play. They're physical. They're tough. They, they're strong. They would not give up. And they resemble... All the attributes of their coach. That's has. tough. And, and it's going to be a <laughs> tough game. It's going to be a physical game. We, we, we're going to have to stop the run, and we're going to have to some kind of way run the darn football. So back okay. to the basics, as you yeah. often say. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Run the ball, blocking and tackling. Oh, that's what it comes down <laughs> to every week. It's what it comes down to every week, and they get more. I think they get more frustrated than 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 I do because they know what we want and what I expect the standard and, uh, yeah. when they don't get it I think you got a you got a, a group of guys that tries to hold each other accountable mm-hmm. then you got some just don't and you know we're gonna deal with that until mm-hmm. the season is over that's how you but be successful they do a great yeah. job of trying to hold each other accountable 
I love it. We were going to take a quick break here on Coach Prime's playbook, but we got a lot of fun coming up. We're going to have some fun oh, when Lord. we come back because I, I mean, you got to. We got. I feel like the most two most fun <laughs> Sanders in the household, right? Yes. All right. We're, gonna, we're coming back on the other side. But... We got a lot more coming up. Morris swings it right side, and it's picked off by Travis Hunter. You bro. have got to be kidding me! What I just saw. Moves to his left. Has all. He got a, a YouTube Lightless channel. One in zone. Touchdown! Touchdown! Colorado. Drops to throw. Question. So, do you think the guys that's there right now that's riding for, for, for prime, for example, Travis Hunter is going to stay? Yeah. 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 Why? I is think that? they will. Why is that? I think because it's bigger than just Dion. You're right. You know what I'm saying? You're right. Like even though he there and he helping out, right? I think it's they a part of it. Right. You know, it's like if Dion left, right? Like, it would be crazy, ludicrous, mm. because. Like, we here to build a team. Right. We're holding each other accountable. Exactly. Now, if you're in a position where you're going to get a better opportunity, then obviously you're going to take that. Right. But is they going to have a better opportunity than the system and the media attention and the just the, the environment that they're in? Because mm -hmm. some things you can't get. You can't, you get. can't get that environment, that okay. Colorado environment with all of the press, right. all of the pressure, you can't. and all of the glory of right. winning and right. losing. You're like, right. all of that, right. it's a package deal. Good nope. answer. I like it. Good answer. Oh, quick throw upside. It is picked off, and this one's going for a touchdown. Here he goes. 25, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown. Shy Low Sanders. Love that. Hey, well, welcome back to New Coach Prime's <laughs> Playbook. And I'm glad we ended on that highlight because there's a lot of controversy about the, the high step, the no high step there. Bro. Take us through why, why we didn't high step. There. I high step. Because the guy was running them down. Okay. No, I ran a 21.5, which is really fast. Uh, oh, Lord. I high stepped in high school one time. Uh-huh. Okay. From a kick return. Okay. And he actually got mad. So I did it from no, like, I didn't. The I played like I was mad. The 35 yard line. <laughs> it I was did a it. TV game. He said, <laughs> and I played like I was mad because I was on television. And I okay. told you if you high step, I was gonna come over to you and play like I'm yelling at you, but I'm really not yelling at All you. Right, okay. <laughs> that's hard. You, bro, that's hard, bro. That's hard, bro. That is hard, bro. That man like a a, a homeboy. That's, that's what, bro. Having a dad, it's like, it's like obviously they have respect for him. You yeah. Know what I'm saying? As a dad, but it's like. I can still be me around, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I don't have to, like, be uptight. I can still, you know, that's hard. Facts. He had one I of those situations that. where he was on the TV cutting up and he got to the crib yeah. and he said, like, like, I like that high step bro. out of you. <laughs> good job, bro. I like that high step nah, out of you. So. That's what, hey, that's one of them good moments so, to where it's like, so. oh, okay, I see what you, yeah. Nah, that's hard. And then that, that build that relationship, that trust to where I could be me, you could be you, exactly. even though we business mm -hmm. first, mm -hmm. we could also be father and son, son. have fun, you know? That's hard. <laughs> So I'm they, glad you have to pretend like you were mad. Because he high stepped and we got a penalty. Okay. Oh, so okay. I couldn't applaud that. Mm. Oh, so the penalty made it make a difference. He did, he did. It's an ESPN game, too. Yeah. But I was about to do that, but I was like, I just had flashbacks to the high We had already okay. planned it. We know he's going to break one. That's the thing about it. I said, I'm going to walk, walk over to you and I'm going to play like I'm yelling at you. Just shake your head. And do it. So that's yep. what happened. <laughs> that's hard. Now, I like, I like how the rest didn't throw a flag for my celebration. I just waited till I scored and. You know that guy was running you down, though, son. I promise you, he was. Yes, he was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we, you know, we might do those like go back to the videotape. Mm -hmm. We'll check it out later. This, this is the problem. You got to understand. Shallow is that that son that keeps you on your knees and keeps you praying. Uh -huh. He's that guy. <laughs> I don't even do that what? much bad. He, he's that much bad always is been that guy. His whole life, he's always been that guy. Does he remind you of you? No, I was never like that. I was never problematic to to uh, my, Grandma my did say she used to whoop you. Uh oh. Like, yeah. <laughs> Everybody got spankings back then. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the culture we grew up in. Right. Yeah. Everybody talk got about it. <laughs> well, I obviously can't not bring up the kid rankings. I feel like we haven't talked about them in a while. Right. Where is your standing at the moment, Shiloh? I'm usually number one, as you can see. Lying, you go on his Instagram. Bro, bro he just said to chew the child. You gotta, he bro gotta pray lying. for. He's not one. Bro. He's not one. Bro, bro he bro. just exposed you, bro. Okay. Oh my God. I'm his profile picture. <laughs> that is true. That is true. So I see. feel like there's a, a lot of impression that you're lower down yeah, on the list. See, when you posted the list, <laughs> I think he was five. Yeah. That was an old list. That's an old list. You know what? He How'd has, you work your way up? He has moved up. I've just been myself, you know? It just happens. Like he that. hadn't done anything stupid to make me mad. <laughs> <laughs> really, really, the thing, how, how it goes, I just remain me, and then they do 
stupid things. Okay. Like my mm -hmm. siblings would do stupid things. I like it. So by default, like, you know. I'm just and he there. will let you know what they did so he could go up in the rain. Wow. <laughs> Snitch. <laughs> 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 he, will, he will throw you up under the bus in a heartbeat. I mean, you're, you're competitive on the field. I assume you're competitive off. Oh, you got, you got to keep tabs, right? Much. That's very everybody who's competitive. Any commercial we shoot gets mad at uh, why do the other kids make the same amount of money he does? I mean, just... <laughs> it's, 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 <laughs> She should not. Bro, having a commercial with the whole fam is crazy, crazy cold, bro. bro. That's like crazy. legacy. Like, you know, like, bro, they gonna always have that no matter what. No like, matter you gonna be what. able to go on the internet, find and, that video of the whole family. All the time, bro. Facts. Bro, that's dang near better than the family photo, bro. No, real stuff, fam. Same amount of money he does. I mean, just... <laughs> it's, 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 <laughs> she should not be getting as much money as I do. There's no way. Yeah, I mean, every day. Look at the contract. And I know you're the one who told them what to pay everybody. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. You, you, maybe you need your own agent. Yeah. I am his agent. I don't know. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, one thing I think about when you think father and son duos, you got the name on the back, so you're already carrying that legacy. You get, you yeah. get 21. Yeah. I'm curious, do you feel pressure or pride in doing that? Sit up, please. Oh, well, damn. I'm sitting regularly. <laughs> Thank you. He kind of. Uh, there's no <laughs> pressure. Yeah. Because I've been that number since I was like six years old. Yeah. Bro. But uh, crazy thing is, I was 21 too. For real? Yeah. Dang, that's hard. Just cause of him. <laughs> G. Yeah. S I played corner. Prime. I started off at corner in high school. Yeah. And then I ended up playing wide receiver, kick return, wide. Dang. Like it was crazy. Prime. And time. I was 21 cause that's how I felt. Um. Prime. Dog. There's just a, a standard that people hold you to that's like really, really high. Mm -hmm. So I have to do like more than average to be average, so. Yeah. yeah. I hold them to a higher standard as well. Sure. Not just on the field, off the field. And yeah. one thing that I love when uh, people come and talk to me about the kids is how respectful, how yes, polite, sir. how courteous, and those attributes. I, I, I love when someone I meet and they don't even know about the conversation come and tell me they met him somewhere, they met one of the kids somewhere. Or one of the girls somewhere, and uh, they were really polite and respectful. Mm -hmm. I love that. You, who you are in real life is exactly who you guys present yourself to be. Yeah. I think that's one of the yeah. things that yeah. Fox Nation has come to love so much about you guys. We got to take a quick break, but we got a lot more coming up here. Stick around. One last segment. Bob. With Shiloh and Coach Prime. Welcome back into Coach Prime's playbook. What a treat! For this episode, we got Coach and we got Shiloh Sanders. Double the 21, <laughs> double the fun. Okay, I got to ask. You said I could ask anything. Mm -hmm. Are we really going to the draft in 2025? You and Shiloh. Well, I, obviously, I don't have a choice because no matter how, whatever I do this season, he just gets on interview and says, oh, next year. They're not going anywhere. You know, he, he said that. This is what Buffs Nation needs to know. No, both of them are coming back. He said that at the beginning of the season when we went to a Broncos game. Yes, I know. And yeah, everybody, we're holding on. Tell me. This. And tell the people, have I ever led you wrong with advice? No, he hasn't. Never. Okay. Valid? Look, I'll tell Never. you what. We here in Buffs Nation, this is what we want to hear. So, so we're going we're gonna to take that as gospel. Right. That's weird. What's your best memory of this season? Shadow, let me start with you. As it starts mm. to come to an end. He's interception. <laughs> He's interception. He's interception. That's his best memory. Um, better, better yet, what, what's your best memory in your childhood? A memory of us. Dang. Best memory okay, in that's a good because the show's wrapped. Come on, come Go. on. I don't know. There's a lot. <laughs> yeah. Ask me something more specific. No, no, give me your best memory. With you, that's hard. I don't you want me to say I'm not going to lie. That's hard to do. It is hard. That's a life lifetime of memories. Yeah. Especially if you have a good dad. Yeah. yeah Y'all just do everything together. He's just a great that's, dad. It's a hard, bro. See, what he should have did is started off with one good memory yeah. and just, just let it keep going. Let yeah, it keep yeah, going. Yeah. <laughs> My best memory doesn't... Like include you in it. Well, my best memory don't include you either. That's what I'm saying. Wow. <laughs> Just move down the list, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you guys think on that. Uh, we, this show is wrapping up. Unfortunately, wait. Well, I actually got mad when it came out. Guys, it's been what? such a privilege. <laughs> no, you did. Like you the wound. Great season. Like, One thanks. last game. We'll see you guys in Utah. You got mad. What do you mean by that? <laughs> came out. What do you mean? I thought he meant like came out the womb. Like when his wife was pregnant and he came out, he was like. What no, if he, he gay, though? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think so, though. I don't think so. I don't think so, but... Bro, how y'all felt about this season so far, bro? Man. I feel like, even though, like, they had these high, high expectations, I was impressed. Yeah. With not only Prime, 
the the guys, the team, but how well they like handled themselves. It was a lot of pressure on them from the beginning of the season. Man, it was. It was, man. It was a roller coaster, but I just feel like the guys have so much to learn and so much to grow from. Yes. And I feel like once they kind of get that and understand that this is a ball game that have to kind of be one with a team aspect, mm-hmm. it's only up from here. Facts. For sure. Facts. Now, y'all like, comment, subscribe, man. More videos coming out. Me and Vex, man. Live in the flesh, man. Shit you feel dope. me? Shit there. You know the vibes. <laughs>